got him. <laughs> Look at that shit. <laughs> that was funny. What's up, fam? It's your boy again. We're back for some more Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Blackout playing in the background. The fast tongue twister. Now, check this out. Welcome to the channel, fam. Everybody that's watching the video is basically the fam. It's basically a fam, a family member. So, always leave a like, comment, and remember, I love my subs. So, let's check it out. So, we're getting the um, we're we're gonna get on uh, January 15th. We're gonna get the new update, which is a 1.11, 1.11 update. Now, to celebrate 115 days that Black Ops 4 has been released on that day, on the 15th. They, they're gonna call it the 115 day celebration event so that's gonna be on January 15 it'll be 115 days so they're gonna have a, a bunch of stuff going on and most of it's gonna be revolving around zombies now so this is what they're talking about so kicking off for the 115 day celebration event with zombies double XP zombies uh, double weapons XP and the zombies uh, plasma XP so everything's gonna be double starts at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time January to um, January 15th to January uh, 18th so that'll be three days that's gonna be on all platforms uh, PlayStation PC and of course Xbox now also um, along with the debut they're gonna also have gauntlet they're gonna debut gauntlets for zombies with the new um, epic elixirs on PlayStation and then they're gonna balance the elixirs as well so the gauntlets is what they're talking about is that there's gonna be a round um, you know of course 1 through 30 and it's gonna be kinda of like uh, league play with different rules for each each round so you gotta do a certain things within that round to before after the round ends to complete it if you don't like say you have to uh, melee um, say in the fifth round you have to melee 20 zombies um, and if your team doesn't melee 20 zombies in the in the fifth round Only in the fifth round mind you then you'll get a strike and Then and say if you're in the eighth round you're supposed to get uh, 10 headshots or something like that and then if your team only got eight headshots you get a second strike and you already know three strikes you're out so and these gauntlets are going to be only up to 30 rounds and they say that it's supposed to be like um playable so you uh replayable so you could play them over and over again and it's supposed to you know something to, something new to do for zombies um but they also said that getting to round 30 is going to be extremely difficult so it said most uh the good seasoned players are going to have a really hard time with Vertical getting to round 30 to but there um we'll know more about it once they drop the patch notes on tuesday but yeah that's going to be exciting for all the all my zombie players um so if you are a zombie player let me know down in the comments how did you guys end up liking it what do what do they uh need to improve on it and what would you guys change on it i'm not really much of a zombie uh fan well i like the zombies it's pretty cool how they made make them look and stuff you got to do but I never got into it. I tried to get it into zombies in World War II, and it, it kind of piqued my interest when the game was being released and, um, you know, the sneak peeks and all that stuff. So it was cool to see, and I kind of wanted to get more into zombies, but I kind of never never did. It never really grabbed my interest that much. It did pique it, but did not really uh, take it over or anything like that. But that would be cool to see. You know, give something for the zombie community to do. Um... And, and if you do make it to round 30, you know, you're going to have special stuff like special calling cards. Um, basically, sh uh, stuff you can show off, like bragging rights. Um, they probably have tiers where you're going to have, like, uh, like how we got echelons in here in Blackout, where you get to level 80, you know, you get the star or whatever. Um, so it'll probably be something like that, you know, that they're going to do in Zombies. So all that's going to be kicking off on Tuesday, January 15th at 10 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. Um, so with the update, as uh, for the one point one one update uh, evolution and and Amagascar are, are going to be added to the rotation to the map rotation of multiplayer also um, another thing that we're going to be getting of course and I talked I talked about this in my last video um, in blackout was that we're going to get the new interface for the um, the looting the uh, death stashes 
you know, we're gonna have either the two rolls of five or the three rolls of five. That way we could loot um, the, the death stashes a lot faster. And they're gonna fix a couple of the glitches where, you know, of course we, we all experienced them where we were trying to loot the bag and had to like step away from it and go back to it. So hopefully that'll be fixed because that's kind of annoying still. Um, and, the, and the ladders, climbing the ladders, I like to run towards the ladder and jump on, on the ladder. And most of the time, like 99% of the time I get stuck and I have to like climb back down the ladder. Well, it'll, it'll make me stuck on the bottom part of the ladder so I have to like get off the way and then get back on it. Basically it wastes time. But anyways, um, so back to the gauntlet. So there's, they were talking about they're going to be endlessly replayable in a competitive setting. So rules for each of the 30 rounds are permanent set and the gauntlet matches are timed. So, with that being said too, if the gauntlet matches our time, you know, there's going to be people trying to beat that, their time, you know, it's going to be very competitive. Um, so, that, like I said, it's going to be a lot of stuff for zombies uh, fans to do because they haven't really been, they haven't been really doing much for zombie players. And, and you can see that with stuff on Twitter, like, oh, here goes something for Blackout, oh, here comes something for multiplayer. Um, so, they're, you know, uh, Blackout kind of took over multiplayers in the rear but zombies is like dead last dragon butt you know so it's good to see that they are showing some effort um giving the zombie community something to do but with that fam that's all i got for you i'll check you guys out later let me know down in the comments what you guys think about if you guys do play zombies about the gauntlet um zombies um i don't know i might just check it out and give it a try just to see what it's all about you never know. I probably will. Just to, just to see what they do for the gauntlets. Um, other news: Activision and and Bungie that make the um that make Destiny two. They're like separated. Activision no longer publishes um, Destiny, so they're going to go on their own. So that's kind of good for uh, Bungie. You know, they're basically being on their own and stuff. So hopefully, but I seriously doubt that Activision's going to do that with Call of Duty because that's Activision's bread and butter is Call of Duty. Anyways, fam, with that, I'm out. Hope you guys like the content that I provided for you guys. Hope you guys like the commentary. Let me know down in the comments if you guys do, like I said, play zombies. If you guys are interested in the gauntlet. And let me know how you like it. Or they need to improve on what they got to do better to keep you guys interested in playing zombies. Like I said, I'm not big into zombies, but it is what it is, fam. And with that, I'm out. Leave a like, comment, and I love my subs. And check this out. This guy had nowhere to go. He was just stuck on that rooftop. <laughs> nowhere to go. I think he just gave up. <laughs> Alright, fam. With that, I'm out. I love you guys. Leave a like, comment, and I love my subs. <laughs>